Senor. Where's the count? Did you see him? Troth, my lord, I have played the part of Lady Fame. I found him as melancholy as a lodge in a warren. I told him, and I think I told him true, that your grace hath got the good will of this young lady. Lady Beatrice hath a quarrel to you. The gentleman that danced with her told her she is much wronged by you. <sighs> oh, she misused me. She told me, not thinking I had been myself, that I was the prince's gesture, that I was duller than a great thaw, hurtling jest upon jest with such impossible conveyance upon me that I stood like a man at a mock with a whole army shooting at me. She speaks poniards and every word stabs. And so indeed, all disquiet, horror, and perturbation follows her. Hey, look, here she comes. Will your grace command me any service to the ends of the earth? Fetch you a hair from the great sham's beard. Do you any embassage to the pygmies rather than hold three words conference with this harpy? Do you have no employment for me? None but the desire of your good company. Oh God, sir, that is a dish I love not. Come, lady, come. You have lost the heart of Senor Benedict. Indeed, my lord, he lent it me a while, and I gave him use for it, a double heart for his single one. Marry once before he won it of me with false dice, there were. Your grace may well say I have lost it. I have brought Count Claudio, whom you sent me to seek. Why, how now, Count? Wherefore are you sad? Not sad, my lord. How then? Sick? Neither, my lord. The Count is neither sad, nor sick, nor merry, nor well, lord, but civil, civil as an orange, and something of that jealous complexion. In faith, lady, I think you're blazing to be true. But I'll be sworn his conceit is false. Here, Claudio, I have wooed in thy name, and fair hero is one. I have broke with her father. Name the day of marriage, and God give thee joy. Count, take of me my daughter, and with her my fortunes. His grace has made the match. Speak, Count, is your cue. Silence is the perfect herald of joy. I were but little happy if I could say how much. Ladies, you are mine. I am yours. Speak, cousin, or if you cannot, stop his mouth with a kiss and let not him speak neither. <laughs> <laughs> 